I love it. The DI2 is awesome. Um, it's, I mean, I think once you ride the DI2, you can't go back to mechanical. It's so nice. It's so sweet. It's so fast. And it, it handles the shifting under load um, really well. And that, I think that's my favorite thing about it is when I'm going hard on a climb, okay. I can shift. Either direction, I can shift. No problems at all. Going from the small ring to the big ring, coming over the top of a climb where you have a sprint, um, no problems at all. Really fast transition. It's... It's incredible. I love it. Is there such a big difference with the old system? Um, between the mechanical and yeah. the DI2? Um, I think so. I mean, the Durace mechanical is really nice, uh, but the the difference between the two is just, once you've used it, it's it's so fast and so easy. Um, it's, it's amazing. And the other thing for me, when I'm home, yeah. uh, the um, just... From a, uh, I'm not a mechanic. Okay. So I, you know, as far as keeping the bike working, it's like once you have it set, it's always working. Mm -hmm. You know, you go out on a four-hour training ride in the rain, and your cables don't get dirty or stretch or anything. It's like the bike is always shifting perfectly, um, day after day, week after week, and the battery lasts so long you forget to charge it. Um, but it's yeah, it's I love it. It's really nice. Okay. What are your expectations for the rest of the season? Um, again, big expectations. You know, riding with HTC High Road is a uh, it's a huge opportunity, and I think we have great we have a great team. We have great staff with us. Um, you know, the attention to details is there. Um, we get to do good races. So, you know, I my number one goal is to be a good teammate, um, and so hopefully to be able to be in the right place at the right time for my teammates in the races I do, and when I have the opportunity to win um, or find my way on the podium, the goal is always to do that.